you could simply do retail arbitrage bundles from like the dollar store where I've seen people do millions of them. They do utensils or they do something like pot holders and towel sets and things like that from the dollar store where you could literally be spending, you know, six bucks on something and creating bundles for that. So how much money does it take to create bundles? Well, depends on what kind of things you're bundling, where you're starting with and what kind of budget you have. Now, a rule of thumb could just be that you're going to just spend a hundred bucks and you're going to buy 10 of the same bundle that you're going to create test bundles and say you're going to get those from the dollar store and you're going to spend your cost of goods that you're going to put four products in which is about five bucks at this point and you're going to spend five dollars on those bundles maybe you're buying 10 of those bundles so that could be like 50 60 bucks maybe you need a little bit of packaging that's another 25 30 dollars depending on where you get it and how much you get it for and all that kind of stuff and you're just trying out a bundle so if you like literally could do a whole test run of a bundle from the dollar store for less than $100. Now, if you're starting with a wholesale catalog, then generally speaking, you're probably gonna have to buy about a case of whatever is there. They usually have minimum orders you need to meet, so it doesn't have to be expensive. As a matter of fact, you can even start wholesale for less than $300 with no minimum orders by tomorrow. Like.